Hi everybody, I've um, been working on this video for a while, actually the post uh, turned out to be on a Facebook, um, turned out to be so big and uh, the post was about false twins, why the twin flames end up in a false twins and um, the most four reasons are um, are a describe uh, into the post that I made it on the Facebook but I decided also to make the video because uh, uh, people love to hear this stuff and uh, in the video I on the post I also say I'm gonna be go a little bit more deeper into it um, why uh, the twin flames uh, end up in the false twin flames uh, uh, relationships mm. The four more common uh, uh, points out or reason why Twin Flames happens uh, that is that uh, there is a lot of interference between the pair of the, the two twins. Uh, you know, to remind you the Twin Flames, it's a soul connection. Uh, it's not uh, like a um, normal relationship. Uh, basically, you know, we have uh, vibrations inside as a body and uh, physical vibration. Usually, people, you know, express their uh, um, physical vibrations, uh, uh, their physical uh, emotions to the vibrations of the body. You can actually feel it if they have love, uh, the sexual love, or they have an anger, they want to fight. Uh, if they have uh, this. Uh, um, um, other feelings inside of them that they want to express to the body to the physical um, we also have uh, the energy vibrations that those energy vibrations you don't really have to look somebody so hard so you can feel them how they feel the energy between you and them just telling you like what to do if that's love you feel the love if that's a uh, anger or aggravation issue is kind of like hey Heads up, the red light comes up. That's a different energy, stay away. Um, also, the energy could be um, very intense uh, at some point. Uh, the other vibration is the heart. Uh, the heart, that is a vibration uh, within the love, how the people feel. If you hurt somebody, you will know. If uh, you love somebody, that's the moment that you know that you love somebody. Um, that vibrations between the two hearts uh, when they love each other if they're separated the one feels the other the need and they usually uh, text or call at the same time they start have uh, understanding of the synchronizations on it um, but twin flames they have it's vibrations within inside of the soul uh, deep down inside of you, there is a vibrations in the soul, and when the two twin, twin flames, they have those same vibrations on it, they vibrate and they meet, and that's that big boom that happens into it. And when that happens, is that uh, everybody knows. Uh, they feel this uh, light. They feel this uh, incredible connection. They feel this need to talk. They feel this need. Uh, for things to happen, but uh, this is the time where the learning is going on for the twins. The one has to learn their things, the other has to learn the other things, and usually those vibrations, um, they go up and up and up until the one is actually is like, I can't take this anymore, I'm going down, the other one is like, what happened to it, I gotta go up, I have to increase, until they go back down on point of time they're gonna find out that they have to find this balance and the peace between them doesn't matter where they are what they are with who they are if they're in a relationship and not in a relationship the two souls they will seek in each other over time but um, the thing is about the false twin flames is number one there is going to be interference within the, between the pair um, this is a very huge one because um, the society can interfere, the old beliefs can interfere, the race belief can interfere. In my case, the language will interfere. You know, if you don't speak their language, that's a big problem. You can't really express the stuff that you need to express, and there is no things that you need to learn because it it is what it is. Um, the other most common thing uh, it, it's the different age. Um, a lot of the twin flames uh, 
uh, have a different age and there is a twin flames they say well um i don't have a age gap between me i'm like uh, okay this is doesn't require for everybody but it's a very common uh that the twin flames have an age gap uh, the only difference is they have this age gap it's about uh, to understand that uh, the age body race culture doesn't really matter what's the matter it's the soul of vibration that has to be in peace and activated between the two twins so they can do what they have to do um, now when the two twins they meet they're gonna be separate so they can vow their connection they can understand they have to be in connection doesn't matter what and um, there is a quote I wrote uh, before that the separation is neat like the seat needs to be on the ground they the seat needs to be in a darkness so uh, you will grow you can come in and, and you'll become what it needs to become down the road so it's the same with the twin flames they have to be a little bit separate uh, on darkness so they can understand this and when they're in this darkness they will look for uh, somebody else they will look for something else to connect or something whatever reason they got separated for it they will look for some similar communication with and if you the one of the twins or the the whole twin flame set it's separated for whatever reason and they have to learn stuff they're gonna learn it through somebody else they are going to end up uh, looking with uh, hook it up with somebody they going to learn that as a karmic lesson or they're going to help somebody usually divine powers will set you up they're going to end up with somebody who's going to help them to move on on the next step move on understanding the next situation move on to understand the next stuff and those people they're gonna have exactly the vibrations like your twin they're gonna be connected with you in the soul uh, the only part that is is that if you try to get into the physical level for most of the case it's not gonna work even if you end up let's say getting together and be in whatever in a relationship your soul it's already connected deep inside of it with your twin and that's not gonna change it doesn't matter whatever you do uh, we'll talk about later on uh, on the video what's that all about because one of the reasons of the twin flames is uh, you to learn that you have to have a hundred percent commitment to your twin and we'll talk about that later on and you end up with the false twin to fill up the gap that gap is uh, for the knowledge that you need to learn that knowledge you need to learn to tell and help others because when um, things have to happen in life and you have to be up here but for whatever reason you are not there yet you're not here up there uh, something has to be move you up so the universe the law of attraction knows the certain things are written in the stars and if you have to write something the way that I was, uh, I had to become a writer. I had to write all those posts about Twin Flames, is that I had to be up here. But the separation between me and my twin was down there, even below. So I had to be connected to other people so I can be up there. I can learn the things that I needed to learn for the Twin Flames so I can be able to express it and help um, everyone that uh, I'm helping right now. Um, and uh, this is the one of the main reason why uh, uh, the false twin flames it happens because if you something interfere there's gonna be uh, something that's gonna help to reach that goal um, I mean this is like the third law of Newton you know every force got its opposite uh, force with the same uh, of power but the um, separate direction so if you something pull you down guess there is gonna be a, um, a force that's gonna pull you up and it's what the interference of uh, of the divine powers are very very huge because they hook you up with the people and the soul just like that um the other thing why the, 
the false twins happen it's uh, lessons to be learned for the public uh, what I mean by that is that um, there is so many stories written there is so many movies made there is so many songs that are written there are so many books about love and relationship and things is that uh, people have to stop interfere um, between uh, individuals doesn't matter what's the situation what the case doesn't matter what the things are because um, when two people get together and any connection doesn't matter if that's a friendship connection it doesn't matter if that's a relationship connection it doesn't matter if that is a uh, partnership connection uh, love connection physical connection or even in our twin flames which is his soul connection which is so deep and intense um, they should not interfere um, they should not be a people put it in together because the divine powers have their own will and they're gonna teach uh, whoever they need to teach what you need to teach um, the main point of that um, is that uh, um, the public will learn the lessons through the story that's going to be told. Uh, one way or another, the story of the Twin Flames will be told. I mean, that story will be uh, in there, will be put it, will be broadcast, or will be told, will be written, or for some reason, is going to be told. And um, all that story is about that uh, comes to the final point is that uh, after you're done with all the full twins flames and you're learning that you need to have, you become to understanding that um, deep down inside of the soul you can have only one connection and that is your twin. You can run, you can hide, you can lie, you can whatever you want to do it, you can't run away from from gotten your twin that's that's who it is they are made at the same time as you are made you are separate from them they vibrate like you vibrate like them doesn't matter time and space it is what it is you're connected to them and to the final point is that um, you have to go and make that uh, commitment to your twin if you got a connect together with your twin somewhere place up here but you are not made a full commitment you will stay here you will stay stuck on this level you can always open the door for somebody else to walk in but not them you don't make that commitment that okay I'm done that's the commitment universe knows God knows everybody knows why would I go and I will uh, uh, end up in a relationship with somebody else when my soul in the middle of night it's only about my twin and this is divine powers that actually start exploring inside of you about the Ten Commandments you know you can't lie you can't cheat you can't do anything you can only be with the one and then you're gonna uh, learn all those divine uh, powers within the relationship that um, Twin Flames is uh, very, very divine because uh, uh, inside of it, if you take a look at it, those are the two soul charges uh, of the one soul and the only thing that it's between them is God. So like, if you draw one triangle, um, the one twin is in the bottom, the other twin is in the bottom, and God is in the top. There is just only that triangle. And um, this is one of the reasons why uh, people there are like, how will I know it's my twin? Well, if you're deep inside of your soul, you're connected to God, and your twin brings you more towards God or towards the divine, then that's your twin. And only you, your twin, and God knows about this. You can go out, you can try to figure out some people to tell you for 100%, hey, is that my twin? Uh, your soul only knows. That people um, who try to, to tell you, hey, for sure, he's your twin. No, 
your soul knows who your twin is. And that is the um, that folk part of the twin flames that uh, you will test everything in you. I mean, everything. Religious belief, a different race, a nationality. I mean, you, you name it. I mean, culture. I mean, there is a cases that I've been talking there, a different culture. Um, I mean, for example, you know, I'm going to put it away. It's a, um, also describes in the movie from, uh, from India that uh, in some of the cases, you know, uh, uh, the parents decide who you're going to get married. And when uh, two twin flames, uh, they're getting uh, together and they get separate because of that marriage, uh, that it's actually a forced marriage by the parents, um, it's putting that uh, separations between the two, 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 two twin flames. And there is a bunch of uh, Hindu movies that uh, they show this like, hey, you have to consider this. You have to consider uh, this situation. Um, now, this is done because I go through against two old beliefs, but the Twin Flames is two comes in and break the old beliefs and uh, uh, show up, uh, hey, we are two, two souls who are connected to each other. Um, marriage uh, is also a huge problem with the Twin Flames and it is what it is. Um, the hard part for the twin flames is when they wake up in the morning and uh, they feel the need for their twin, but uh, Nick, they're lying in the bed next to somebody else. And the soul, once it's open, cannot lie anymore. You're going to end up in the situation that you have to confess. Or if you are able to balance this between you, your twin flame or your spouse, you're going to end up in the living hell. <laughs> Until you comes in a point that uh, uh, you have to choose. And if you don't have your twin flames, uh, you will look for somewhere that you're going to connect uh, with an, uh, uh, false twin flames and you're going to learn that you have to make the commitment. Somebody who comes in in your life is going to be like, commit, okay, don't lie. And that will be your soul inside of it. And if you don't listen to your soul, guess what? Um, the soul is going to whisper at the beginning. If you don't listen, it's going to start uh, talking to you a little louder and louder and louder and louder and louder. It is going to start screaming in your face until you don't hold it anymore. Or if you keep on going against this, uh, it's going to be the dark night of the soul, not night, night of the soul. Uh, he's going to come in and uh, you basically going to have this near death experience and then you're going to be awakened. And this is a part that um, sometimes the real twin awakens. But if you don't learn with uh, your real twin, you don't have chance to learn with uh, your real twin. You are going to learn with somebody else when you have soul relationship not uh, a physical not a heart relationship but the soul relationship because the soul it has gonna have these vibrations inside so uh, you have to do your uh, things that you need to do you have to do the missions that you need to do and um, be proud of that you are a twin flame it doesn't matter if you learn it with somebody else or you learn with it through a, another twin flame. There's going to be a point of time that you have to open up yourself um, and publicly come out as a twin flame to serve. Um, I'm going to be making another one video that is going to be exactly about this part, um, which is going to be made it right after this one. Um, and another point, uh, I think I'm missing something. Another point here for the um, false twins is that um, they're not actually false. Those are like a soulmates to you. They comes in to lift you up, to boost you up. 
and you have to be nice to those people doesn't matter what uh, the situation is I mean they may gonna end up breaking uh, uh, that soul relationship for whatever reason uh, they may um, connect disconnect with you uh, for whatever cases um, but once the lesson is learned it's learned and that connection between you and them is going to be disconnected and you have to uh, appreciate what they did for you also they have to appreciate what you did for them because uh, you probably mutually learn things that you needed to learn uh, for the common good and uh, we'll leave you with this and uh, I will see you in the next video be loved